Hey guys, this is Cloudy Rato. Uh, in our previous tutorial on Python, we discussed on uh, uh, various aspects of string manipulation of strings and operation on the strings. Now, in this tutorial, we will uh, discuss on uh, the list, which is, in, uh, which is uh, one of the data type in Python. If we talk about the data structure in Python, so the most basic data structure in Python is sequence. Uh, and every element of sequence have an index which represent it location or position. Normally, the first index is 0, then 1, and so on and so forth. Basically, Python support 6 built-in sequence and we will see it later. We already discussed one of it, uh, that was string. So, in today's tutorial, we will focus on the list and different operation on the same. So the most basic data structure in Python is sequence and each element of the sequence is assigned a number. So start with how to create a list. Now see how to create the list. So first of all, we need to write uh, as I already write my name that is cloudy. Um, cloudy underscore list equals to square bracket. Uh, sorry, it's equal to square bracket. Uh, we successfully create one list, but we know this is a empty list. So if I print the uh, same, that is cloudy underscore list, then it will shows nothing. Now how to put values in the list? So to put values in the list, write the cloudy or oh, mm, no need to write mm, underscore only. So just write cloudy and then put some value that is number and it and print the same. Now write cloudy and you will get the output of the list. Uh, can we uh, put uh, different values in the list means having uh, different data types. So try for the same cloudy equals to uh, for example if I put cloudy that is uh, data type uh, string uh, then uh, 3.14 that is a floating value and 13 that is an integer value and try to make the list now hit the button and try to display the same now you will see it displays the output of the list having different data types and uh, we have no problem with the same. Now in the same way, uh, we can make the list uh, like uh, cloudy equals to cloudy rato over then uh, one then we can embed or cascade more than one list in the same that is this is different list within the list and uh, in third list i just put one character so one character in the list and now close the list now see what will happen uh, i think we done some mistake in the same so try to find out the mistake first so if you look closely you will find we done a mistake here okay now now try to access the same so right now we have three separate list within the same list and it contains three different data types Okay, one character, one string and uh, uh, numbers. So, we can play with some more things. So, instead of typing a, uh, the lengthy uh, list, I just paste here and then enter. Now, I paste the cloudy router, uh, the list as a cloudy router and now try to access the same. Now we can also access the list by negative index. 
now see how to uh, represent it uh, sorry how to access it by negative index now try uh, 0 colon minus 5 now guess what will be the output if you if you remember our uh, in our uh, previous uh, uh, tutorial I, I show you one uh, table now according to this table the first yellow strip contains the numbers before the colon the blue strip contains after colon and so on and so forth now according to this table now guess what will be the output of this code so 0 to minus 5 means cloudy r now see the list this is before colon so 0 that is c and this is after colon that is minus 5 that is r so according to this table you will find the output of the same so in our next tutorial we will find some more tips and tricks on list till then see ya